people love fast internet, but I like the slow internet. Because with fast internet, people can play games more efficiently and quicker. With my slow internet here, at our school, it's our policy to have slow internet. I took away a couple of USBs because they were hacking into the web, the internet to make it faster so they could play games. I was catching them every second at, while they were playing their games. And so, stick to slow internet people because the results are better in life. Look at this guy, he had fast internet. Hey, I remember you. Is that Billy? Yeah. Did you, you were the kid who used to always hack and get fast internet. <laughs> yeah, right, that's Now look at you, you're, you're a druggo. Yeah. When I was in school, I used slow internet. Sci scientific research has shown that kids with slow internet will progress to get a better job and a better future. Man, I wish I had slow internet. What the internet? No, why is it buffering? Oh, yes, I'm so good at this. I'm a hundredth out of a thousandth. Make the internet slow. Hey, yes, stop them from playing their games. Yes, yes, yes. What? I'm glitching. My game froze. What? I'm first. Yes! I love slow internet because, you know, in class when you're playing those games, that, you know, you just have to do your work. So basically, I love the slow internet because it gets glitches you always the first and you just don't want to play your games anymore because they're that boring. So. Interview. We are interviewing Dr. Lockie James. Here he is now. Hi. So Lockie, today I'm going to ask you a couple of questions about how you compared your slow internet and to your fast internet. So, with slow internet, we've found that students um, get more work done because they're handwriting it and they're not relying on the internet, so they're not distracted by like all the, the games and you know, all the stuff on the internet. But then we, when we com used fast internet, people weren't using handwriting; they were just um, like playing games and getting distracted yeah, too yeah. easily. So right, so they were on their computers a lot more with the fast internet. Yeah. And me having a guess right now, because you're that successful right now, mm. I guess you had slow internet in your Yeah, time. I did actually. It, it actually helped me. I, in primary school, I had fast internet, and I never really got much done during primary school. So yeah, yeah. like high school helped me a lot because of the slow internet. Oh, yeah. that's... I guess it's good to have a, that sort of technology now where... Yeah. It's just uh, slow internet, so yeah. thank you for coming, man. Oh, well, thank you. That's, thank, that's thanks, good. Thanks, thanks for having thanks, me. Thanks, man. That's, uh, that's the interview for tuning in next week for another interview. He is one of our most successful students at Deakin University with um, the subject of slow internet. Here is Finlay. Hey, guys. So, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. Yeah. So, um, did you like fast internet? Not one bit. As as um, there, there's lots of uh, been on this show the the interviews that you guys have had that slow internet is actually very helpful for you because you don't play games or you just don't go on internet or anything like that. So you just basically write it out or type it without using the internet. So basically, it makes you a lot smarter in that way. Yeah. Did um any of your friends hack the slow internet to make it faster? Yeah, one of my best mates. He did. He did quite a bit, but now he he liked he liked fast internet where we had slow, so we hacked it to make it slow. But now, now he's a bit of a druggo selling ice under a bridge. So, kids, slow internet's good. Yeah. Today on the interview, we'll be interviewing Brick from Surf Coast Secondary College. Here he comes now. Thanks, guys. It's been a real honour of having me here. So, Brick, what's your opinion on fast internet these days? Oh, I loved it. You know. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed it. So, do you have any advice for kids out there with that have fast internet at the moment? Yeah, just, just stay with slow internet. Well, there you go, kids. If you have fast internet, stop. Use slow internet, otherwise you'll turn out like brick here.
That's all we've got time for tonight, folks. We'll see you next week on the interview. Okay, guys. Today at Telstra, we're intro introducing a new uh, Wi-Fi wi modem. This is our old one. It's a lot faster, but this one's a lot slower and less stable. And so on this contract, you, it'll be $60 a month on a 24-month contract. But you can leave the contract whenever you want if you feel that the Wi-Fi is still too fast. 100% success. 100% work rate. 100% yours!